right down to the basics. This will be a lot quicker than the first episode of Wheel of Two Gathering. Most of you know the rules by now, but there's a couple tweaks. First things first, I want to show you the team. This year, we're changing things up. I was the Detroit MMG last season. It's kind of lame. This year, this year, it's the same year. This season, we are the Seattle misogyny because I hate women. What, are you waiting for a punchline? Are you waiting for me to say I'm joking? I'm not. I'm a misogynist. I hate women. I think men are superior to women. I believe women are inferior. There's no joke here. Don't look for it. The Seattle misogyny is composed of this season we're 90 over up with all amethyst except I got the go invincible Dirk Nowitzki. So my overall team is worse, but I do have a god to carry us. I love using Dirk Nowitzki. You guys know this. Like absolutely ridiculously good. And I love him so much. He's my father. Then I got CP3, Luka Doncic. Love it. Kevin Durant and Shaq on the starting lineup with Kyrie, Bradley Beal, Larry Bird, Scalabrini. I got to pick the amethyst. I want another goat on the bench. <laughs> And then Joel Embiid. So right now, power forward is probably definitely our strongest position. Not probably, it's definitely. Now, let's get into the rules. This is Wheel of 2K revamped. As far as games go, we're doing the exact same thing. The end goal of Wheel of 2K revamped is to have the best record possible. That's my goal anyway. For you guys out watching, I'm sure it's for me to have the worst record possible. It's a 12 episode series, and depending on how my record ends, I will have to complete one challenge. All of these challenges were made by you guys in the comment section of the finale, and they're pretty damn good. If I play 12 games and I don't win a single game, I have to publicly apologize to EA. I'll post a full YouTube video slurping their schmeat. And to be honest with you, I know that's not gonna happen. So it really didn't matter when I put it on 12. There's absolutely no way I lose 12 straight games. But we went eight and four last season. I don't, I don't see it happening. If I go one and 11, I will do a pregnancy prank on my mom. The thing is my mom is so gullible too. I think these are some of the stupidest videos on YouTube because they're all fake as shit. I think they're so dumb. That being said, I know my mom would fall for it and I know it's stress the hell out. It would be actually kind of funny. It's just something that I despise and don't want to do. If I was two and 10, I think this is the first challenge that's actually possible. I will live stream myself on Tinder. We will all just hang out and just talk to girls. That might honestly be illegal. I don't even know if I'm allowed to do that on live stream, but I'll take the charge, baby. You can send me to prison because if I go two and 10, I deserve it. I go three and nine. You guys will choose one spot on my body that has to get waxed. And I will I'll take the camera in. If it's something I can't video record and post on YouTube, I'll do a little blurring out. But I'll make sure I bring a videographer and we actually make that video. If I go four and eight, I'll take one body shot from destroying. I'm talking he can put on the boxing glove and as hard as he can, I'll take one full-fledged punch from him, presumably in my stomach or chest, something like that. Not to the face. No way. This is the moneymaker. Five and seven. You guys can choose an Instagram picture that I have to take. You name the location, you name what I have to do. I'll take the picture, post on Instagram. You also make the caption. I'm really actually horrified of that one and I don't know why I put it at five and seven. That was not smart at all. Now that I look back at this, I can't really go back now. Six and six is the henna tattoo. So many of you wanted this to come back because it's temporary for like two weeks, but also like, you know, if I have a giant cock on my arm, it's gonna be kind of hard to go to the gym. You guys get the idea of that one. If I go seven and five, I'll make a group chat with all of my ex-girlfriends. I don't really want to think about what I have to do if I have to do that. So I'm just gonna pray that I don't go seven and five. I didn't think this through at all. Why did I put that at seven and five? If I go eight and four, this is a really good one. I will simp excessively for one day. So basically you guys can take over my Twitter. I have the verified check now too, so they see this shit. If you're gonna tweet at Summer Ray, Karina Kof, I don't know how you say her name, whatever. And I can just, you take over my Twitter and simp for whoever you want for the whole day. If I go nine and three, I have to call 25 people in my phone and ask politely if I can clap their cheeks. If I go 10 and two, I'm safe. It was nine and three last time but I went eight and four, I was almost safe. So I made it 10 and two. If I'm 11 and one, I still want that essay. You have to type a full paragraph essay on how handsome I am and put it in the comments if I go 11 and one. And if I go 12 and oh, you already know what's happening. I'm clapping your mom's cheeks. You don't have a say in it. I might impregnate her. I don't care. This is the Wheel of 2K cheat sheet. I'll bring this cheat sheet back out for all the episodes you guys are always looped in. Right now, we gotta spin the wheel, spin the challenge wheel, and then hop into a game. The only thing we're adding rule-wise really is the challenge wheel. Completing the challenge wheel lets me open one one of any pack from the store. One wheel spin to add a player to the team. Our challenge wheel, we hop in and claps with cheeks. Our first episode of Wheel of 2K, baby, let's get it! I'm about to get butt naked. Y'all already know this is our first wheel spin of the game! Oh my God, let's go! I just, dude, I, I also updated the wheel like crazy. I just put this on there, bro. This is a My Team Dark Matter Premier Pack. It guarantees a random Dark Matter player. I'm actually ready to go. I don't have to do anything else. One Dark Matter player. 
As long as it's not Dirk, it's gonna be sick. Let's go. Boom, baby. Come on now. What do we got? What do we got? Western Conference, 99 overall, number 17. I have literally no idea who that is. No, bro. Dude, I, I literally look racist. I have Dirk Nowitzki, Luka Doncic, and Jonas Valanciunas. I don't want you, bro. Ugh. I'm not racist, you guys. I'm serious, I'm not racist. I have tons of black friends. Just ask anybody. Go with guys like so Shaq's coming out, and then I'll take Embiid off the bench because I do like the 91 Shaq, and 91 Shaq will go to the bench. Valenciunas, bro, what? I got Lithuania, Slovenia, and Germany on this starting lineup. I'm kind of being an asshole. This is a really good pull. It's a dark matter. And I got Dwayne Wade's white brother, oh, Dean Wade. All right, I'm racist. I figured it out. That gives us a 93 offense, an 88 defense, and a 90 overall squad. All right, let's get it to the Wheel of 2K Challenge. Well, baby, the first time we've ever used it. I'm really excited to see we can get uh only one player can score for one quarter 10 points Ooh. Shit. Shit. 10 points with the worst player means 10 points with dean wade 69 overall power forward dean wade who desperately wants to be Dwayne wade but is not if you know how i feel why would you say that Shit. Wow, that was not optimal for the first challenge real spin. Well, you know what? I said this first episode would be a banger, and it's gonna be a banger. Also, of course, a huge thank you to Raycon for sponsoring today's video. I've got my everyday earbuds right here in this awesome blue. Raycon is so awesome because they make premium wireless earbuds, but they're about half the price of the other stuff you used to see. My personal favorite is they fit in my ear so well. I've used other brands, especially when I go to work out, they just fall out. Raycons do not, that's why I love these things. And of course, they sound amazing too. Six hours of playtime, seamless Bluetooth pairing, a more compact design, and more bass makes these puppies awesome. They also have dope color raises and a variety of fit options, so it'll definitely be staying in your ear. And it was co-founded by Ray J. Celebrities like Snoop Dogg, J.R. Smith, Mike Tyson, they all use Raycons, and they all love them. And a 45-day free return policy. I don't think you use it, though. I think you're gonna love the earbuds. And for me this summer, my Raycons are coming with me five days a week to the gym. So to get some new earbuds, click the link in the description box or go to buyraycon.com forward slash MMG to get 15% off your Raycon purchase. Raycon, thank you for sponsoring, guys. Enjoy the rest of the video. Okay, he has an absolute god squad of Galaxy Opals and Dark Matters. Well, I guess I wouldn't call it a god squad, but compared to my team, that is god squad. To be honest, I don't even like getting the tip. <laughs> the tip. That sounds bad when I say it like that. I don't like getting the jump ball at the start, because I like to have the ball in the second and third. Good D, Chris Paul. Luca, you want to pull? Oh. Nope. Space Jam LeBron on 91 Amethyst. Luka Doncic. Wow, dude, I'm disrespecting the jersey. Oh, okay. I'll take a free bucket into Dirk. Oh, shit! All right, Valenciunas. Valenciunas is starting out pretty good. Maybe I shouldn't talk so much shit about him. Also, I think you guys need to give me more credit. I'm gonna be totally honest. You guys need to give me more credit. I'm not a 2K YouTuber. I don't play a lot of 2K, but my name pronunciations are usually pretty good, and I'm not horrible at 2K. Hold on. And I'm not horrible at 2K. And I'm not horrible at 2K. Chris Paul into the lane. Dirk out wide. He closed out late. Ah, uh, it was enough. All right, bro. He is jaded that I was talking shit about him. He's pulling for even This dude's got Dark Matter, Luka Doncic, and he's going to kill me with him. And I'm wearing a Doncic jersey. Yup, got him jumping, and that should be a dunk. Oh, come on, buddy. Maverick on Maverick Crime, six to six. He's just going to bully me out there. I don't know how I'm going to stop that. Ooh, that was, oh, he missed that? That was such an easy shot. I have no idea how I'm gonna get past this, Luca. Oh, easy roll, easy roll, that's a bucket. No. What the fuck was that? Are you kidding? What kind of sorcery was that? Oh my God, he's bringing another one from up there. Amethyst Durant is open and he hits it, that's clutch. With minimal effort. There goes Dirk. All right, we'll take that. 17 11, though. Where's the help side? Honestly, for what feels like a massacre, I really don't mind a six point game. Scalabrini! This guy, with all his dark matters, is honestly kind of struggling versus my Amethyst squad right now. I have only Amethyst in, it's a four point game. And look at Kyrie go right. Oh. I thought that was a free bucket. I don't know how you knew about that, bro. 
It's a high scoring first quarter, but I think in the, in the end of this, I'm gonna lose by about 21. You know what I might do? I might just concede that I'm not gonna keep Jonas Valanciunas, even though he's playing like a beast. And I might bring Dean Wade in to try and get my challenge build done. Dude, you're off balling my amethysts. You're actually a beta male. You're such a fucking beta. You are off balling my amethyst team. What, you can't handle fucking Amethyst Kyrie Irving, bro? Okay, that's not an off ball. I respect that, my friend. I respect it. All right, Dean. Dean Wade, number 32, plays for the Cleveland Cavaliers. You know, I'd be lying if I said I had any fucking clue who this guy was. All right, so he's gonna clamp up Dean here. Oh, he's not gonna clamp up. That's a good shot. That's a good shot, Dean. You're 5% covered. We take those, buddy. Honestly, dude, yeah. Dribble in circles, run, pick, and roll. I can't stop you, and I know it. It's okay. I just need buckets for Dean Wade. He's just not going to guard it at all. Could he make that very open? He can't make it right now, but I'm thinking if I keep giving him a couple shots at it, he might. Hey, Larry Legend. Where's Dean? Where the fuck is Dean? God, you slow ass, bro. I need the screen to come from Dean. Exactly. Perfect. Yes, cut to the rack. Give it to Dean. Dean! Ah! That's the black Dwayne Wade right there, baby. Yes, sir. The challenge is doable. And you know, I can always complete the challenge and see if I can get back in the ball game. Dean Wade, get clamped. You just got clamped by the Asian Dwayne Wade. Yup, give him a pump. Get him jumping. Get in the paint. You're small. Dean says you're small. Dude, he's literally the Filipino Dwayne Wade. Look at that, dude. He just clears out. You're gonna give, oh. you're gonna, oh shit. <laughs> I wonder what his three point shot is, probably like 50. Dude, so Dean cannot shoot, it appears. It's definitely gonna be up to our two point buckets from Dean! Oh, he's got six already just in the second. I think I could have made that challenge a little harder. I love to see it, Dean. I'm so proud of you. We gotta get you back in the ball game. Oh, bad ball. LeBron is shooting the lights out. Dude, it's such a bummer. My opponent is not that good. I wish I had a decent team. I would be clapping this man's cheeks if I had a decent team. Valencia spaces for three and oh. Dude, six points for the Western Asian mixed with a black dude, Dwayne Wade. Hey, there's the man. Oh, he's had Della Vidova on him. Stop letting him shoot. He's gonna scrap it. Literally the Pacific Islander Samoan Dwayne Wade. Let's go. Oh, he's got Deli in, bro. He's got Della Vidova, who spaces to Sean Bradley. Dude, don't let me do you up. That's no fun. I want to cross you. Oh, my God. Dude, Dwayne almost just... <laughs> Fucking... Ah! We both just lost the ball standing there, but he picked it up. That's a bummer. Oh, Valencia Yunus is in the passing lane. Dwayne. Ah! Hang on to the ball, buddy. I need you there. Yeah, we kind of knew he was shooting that. Come on, Dwayne! Get to the paint, you only... Ah! Let's go! He's gonna get 10 off of that. Dial it in, baby. Dial it in. With the black Dwayne Wade. Boom! Oh! You need one more, baby, then I can pull you. You need one more point, and I can pull you. <gasps> no! Dude! Go! Just go up with it, baby! No, oh, Dwayne! Ooh, lost him, lost him, lost him! Oh, 11, let's go. All the way to the rack, baby. Come on, LeBron, you're small. And one. And another buttery free throw. Ah, shit. Got him jumping, got him jumping again. Good spacing, go! I love you! Let's go! Challenge wheel complete, I get a pack no matter what. Let's see if we can squeak a win out of this somehow. Luca's a menace, bro, especially on Chris Paul. Yo, I'm glad this guy's a good sport. He was, he was out there putting in Del Vadova when I had Dean Wade in. This is such a mismatch right here. Oh, thank you. I don't mind if I do, and I still got the mismatch. Valenciunas into the paint. That's easy. Yup, let's go. Another green for Dirk, nine seconds left. It was a 20 point game at one point and we're not closing the gap by much, but the gap is closing. I'm not gonna lie. It would be absurdly difficult for me to outscore him by 50. Wow, that's crazy. To outscore him by 18 in the fourth quarter. I mean, I still gotta try, right? Bye, have a great oh my God. Oh, get in there, Scally. 
Boy. Somebody cut. Oh my god. What the what the fuck? What was that? I'm just gonna walk this one down the lane. Look at Chris Paul. Look at Chris Paul. Oh, you're get you're getting dirt fadered on. You already know it, man. Oh, 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 oh. oh I love to see that. How much time do I got on this clock? Oh! Come on, baby! Get big! Yo, and thank God Dirk is locked into this team. No matter what happens, Dirk is locked in. Great defense. And now we're running. You sure you want this, buddy? Easy bucket. You're small. I'm big. It's that simple. One minute left on the clock. Our torture is almost over. See if we can get a few more buckets before we get out of here. Okay. He wants to give me the three? Dirk's a green machine up there, my guy. Yep. As of right now, we outscored him in the fourth quarter. I like that, boys. We showed some grit, and I respect that. Wait a second. Don't hit that. Yep. We outscored him in the fourth. First episode is an L, but I have positive spirits. It was going to be really tough to beat an all-Dark Matter team with our squad, and I get a pack. Now we just have to pray that we get somebody good or, like, at least as close to Valenciunas, because that Valenciunas is so good. Luckily, the Space Jam packs are still in store as I'm recording this. We're guaranteed a Galaxy Opal. Hopefully, we can somehow get a Dark Matter. So Dirk had 28 points, 4 rebounds, 3 assists, a steal, and a turnover. 13 for 20 field goal. That's honestly really good. 2 for 4 from 3. The Mexican Dwayne Wade. Hey, bro 11 points five for nine from the field he's our second leading scorer didn't play bad by any means he really did i mean vlets Yunus was just a boarding machine bro 10 points nine rebounds almost a double double but sadly he's gonna have to leave our team because we did not win scalabrini then was our next leading scorer wow look at the picture for scalabrini that is shit out of that is nightmare fuel Shaq had four chris paul durant yeah hey ggs noah well played my guy thank you for letting me get 11 points with uh the blade Asian Dwayne Wade. And Valencia Yunus. I'm sorry, sir. You're coming out for... Let's put Shaq back as the starter, and then Anthony Davis will come off the bench. Damn, but okay, boys. It's all gonna come down to this one super clutch pack right here. Oh, this pack has to go so hard. So, we have an out-of-this-world deluxe pack. It takes one player and four items, a guaranteed out-of-this-world player, which is Galaxy Opal. The only card I don't want is Larry Johnson. Larry Johnson's a power forward. I already got Dirk, and I don't want Larry Johnson at center. Let's see what we can get, boys. We're literally guaranteed at least a Galaxy Opal. I would not mind a Dark Matter at all, baby. It's gonna be right there. If it's there, it's Galaxy Opal. Darn it. I don't know why I'm complaining. I got my challenge done. I'm guaranteed a 98 overall player here. That is totally fine. Eastern Conference, 98 overall. Is that Ewing or Larry Bird? It's Ewing. He's back, baby. You know what? I'm not crazy ecstatic about that because we did use Patrick Ewing last season. But hey, you know what? I'm happy to have 98 overall. All right, boys. Patrick Ewing is in. He's been reunited. Basically, we swapped. I had Galaxy Opal Dirk and Dark Matter Ewing. Now we got Dark Matter Dirk and Galaxy Opal Ewing. I plan to replace that Ewing, though. I want you guys to see different players other than Dirk, obviously. So I'm really happy right now. We definitely need it for next episode, but yeah, I'm not going to do that much with him. We got out with an additional player and a single loss. So technically right now, I still could publicly apologize to EA. Uh, pregnancy prank on my mom. Everything is on the table right now other than me banging your mom because that was 12 and 0. So now I'm going to go cry in a hole for the rest of my life. <laughs> oh, whoa. I love you, boys. Thank you for watching. As always, it's going to be another banger season, baby. I'll see you tomorrow for episode number two. And then I'll see you the day after episode number three. It's daily again, baby. I love you. Thank you for watching. As always, peace out.